In this video, we're going to cover the use of routines in the Kinetic Task Engine. In the Kinetic Task Engine, routines are defined processes that can be called within task trees. Routines can be thought of as sub-processes that can be called by other trees within the task engine. Typically, routines would be defined for standardized sub-processes, such as approvals, that would be used by more than one master process within an organization. From a practicality standpoint, the advantage of routines is that you can define standardized sub-processes, like approvals, that can be called by many other trees within a task system. The modularity of the design of the task engine allows routines to be iteratively improved across the enterprise. The result is much faster service improvement end-to-end, -end, where process components can be managed independently and easily reused across the entire enterprise. To build a new routine, navigate to the Build tab in the Kinetic Task Admin console and click Routines. From this page, you can import a routine, add a new routine, or view and modify existing routines in the system. You can filter the available routines by searching for the routine name. When you click on a routine, you can see the details, including how often it is used. By clicking on the Edit tab, you can look at the available attributes of the routine, including the routine name, how it's categorized, its inputs, and outputs. This routine is used to send an email to a recipient of a request. Its inputs are the ID of the recipient, and its outputs are the email sent date. We can edit this routine by clicking the Builder tab. Within the Builder, we can see the different functions that make up the routine. We're looking up recipient information, the parent record details, and then the engine will send out the email. If this particular set of functions was not created as a routine, it would need to be replicated across many processes that had the same series of steps in them. If we open up the Send Email Handler, we can see that we're retrieving the recipient's email address from a previously executed node in the routine. We can also see the HTML email body that was built using this routine. It's grabbing details from the Lookup Recipient Information node, as well as the Lookup Parent Record Details node. Upon execution of this routine, we can see that the outputs are returned of email sent date. This output will be available for the process that called this routine. 